So today I want to present the Coke and Dealer demo kit and what it consists of, a bunch of different product lines, pretty much give you a general overview of the different offerings we have. Both our regular hand tools as well as our Z-Series product line. So we start by looking at the first section here and this gives you um, pretty much an overview of every hex that we offer, different types. So you have your standard six point, you have your 12 point there, surface drive, then you have a nut grip socket. And this one's really cool because when you have a bolt, like say it's uh, plastic or stainless steel, rather than having a magnet and not being able to hold it in place, we use these two retaining balls here that allow you to hold that stud or nut in place. And then on this one, it is a pathfinder. So you can actually start running down your tool and it will grab onto that hex. So you can be running and it'll grab onto it. So you don't have to worry about getting it precise. And then we'll move on to our wheel nut sockets, which is actually our number one seller across all markets. What's really unique about these is that they have a really um, narrow shaft, so you get into place a lot easier. We also have a protective covering on the outside, so you don't have to worry about uh, scratching or damaging the wheels. And then there's also a rubber buffer on the inside so that it will make contact with the lug and it won't scratch the paint on that as well. And we offer these in a couple different sizes, 17 millimeter, 19 millimeter, 21 millimeter. We also have uh, another size available as well, but in our standard three set piece here, we offer these three sizes. Then we'll move on to our ratchets. Um, what's really unique about a Koken ratchet is the lightness of the turn. So almost no effort, you can start turning uh, the ratchet. So it's really easy. It's like feather smooth. And we offer these with a couple different handle variations. This one's our knurled grip. We have a, um, a solid finish and also a rubber finish too, depending on your preference. Over here, we have a breaker bar. Same thing here. We have a couple different finishes for the end. Um, essentially, this will help you apply more torque in situations where you have a stubborn uh, nut, you can't get it off. And over here, we have a, another bar that allows you to apply some more force. You need to do that. This is a sliding mechanism. You can lock it in the middle. And what's unique about this shaft here, it's actually an oval, so you can lock it at any point. This here is a spark plug socket. So for any spark plug applications, a couple different sizes in this one as well. It's got the clip in here to retain it on the inside. And then I'll show you uh, this demonstration in a second. But before I do that, I'll go over our fixed wobble extension bar. This is actually a design originally invented by Koken. Um, as you can see, rather than just having a standard square drive at the end, it's, uh, it's got a little bit of a unique shape at the tip. So you can either have, you can push the socket all the way in, use it as a regular extension bar, but if you pull it just a little bit out, you can now use it as a universal. And they call this a fixed wobble. Right here, you have an attack driver. So if you have any rusted out bolts or nuts, you can use that. And then this is also, was originally a patent invented by Koken. Um, like I mentioned it earlier, but it's the oval shaft. This is a spinning, uh, spinning T. So you just slide that through. You can use it to take off your wheel nuts or you can actually use this to apply more torque in certain applications where you have a pesky bolt or nut. In this little demo here, um, you can show your customers our stud setters and pullers. So I'll grab this stud here. 
and this is the setter. So put it in here and you can actually just install it this way. And it comes out easily. So once the stud's set, you start loosening it. The stud will stay in place. And now you have the, the free stud setter. The one next to it is the stud puller. So if you need to get it removed, plug that down there. And it won't damage the threads, and that's the beauty of this. It has ball mechanisms on the inside that will grab threads without actually working. But you can reuse the stud if you needed to. This here is what we call a nut buster. As you can see, you have your standard um, bolt here where the edges are fine, but say there's a point in time where these might've been rounded out, or stripped, this is where the nut, nut buster would come in handy. So due to the unique design of it, it's gonna grab onto it and allow you to spin it. So it's gonna be really tight, but as you can see, it grabbed onto it, and you can begin to loosen that, that, that um, rounded out edge. And this here can also be used um, if you need to drill into some studs. This here is your standard universal socket. So if you're going in at an angle, say you need to get into the engine and you need to avoid some stuff, this will allow you to do that. And then we have a quick change disconnect here. So if you wanted to change out sockets really quick, you have that quick change right here. This is a 3 8 to 3 8 We also have them available in half inch square drive as well. So say you had a 17 millimeter hex for one application and then you were also switch it to a 14. This just makes it really easy. Just pull down, the ball will re retract and you can swap out the sockets. Now I'll move on to the Z series, which is on the other side of this. And what we have set up here will show you the benefits of using the Z series versus your standard um, square drive. So Z series was designed around tight applications. What they did was they designed the ratchets and the sockets to be narrower and shorter to get into those tight areas. For example here, we have a standard 10 millimeter socket, and this is a Z series. As you can see, the height difference is pretty significant. So that way when you're going into certain areas that require those tight tolerances, the Z series would be much uh, better suited for that application. When we uh, plug these in, let's say you used your standard 10 millimeter, there's not too much clearance due to these plastic posts here. However, if you did use the Z series, due to the narrower um, the shaft there, you have a lot more room to play with. Especially when you combine this with one of our extension bars, we'll give you even more room. And the beauty of these ratchets, like I mentioned earlier, is that it's so easy to turn. There's almost no give back. This here is a spinner tool. So say you needed to, you were in that tight application, you, it's really hard to use the uh, shaft of the ratchet to turn. Just have your socket on there and you use your finger to turn it. Then we have our universal joints. With the Z-Series type, these are a lot smaller than the standard universals where they'd be longer and also a little thicker. So once again, you just plug on your socket. Now you have a universal, getting those weird pesky areas.
And one unique ratchet that I'd like to share with you is this quarter inch square drive body, but it has a 3 8 square drive head. So if you ever needed an area where quarter inch drive would typically be used, but you need a little bit more power, um, this will help you get into those tight areas while allowing you to use the 3 8 square drive sockets. So you can use a little bit more torque without worrying about breaking the ratchet. And this one is actually can bend as well. We do make them that are fixed. This one's pretty unique in that it can get into other areas. Another pattern with the Z series is actually the inside of the sockets, the way that they're designed. Now on your typical socket, um, the inside of it is just a circular groove. So that way when you insert the square drive, it locks in. There's a little bit of play in there, as you can see. But what Koken decided to do was redesign that locking mechanism there into what is almost like a half moon crescent. So that way, with the Z series, when the ball goes up into the socket, it's nice and snug. It removes a lot of that play. And you can feel that, especially when um, you're trying to get into a tight area where there's a lot of pushback. And then here's just some different sizes of the Z series offerings. So you have your um, regular, then we call these semi-deep, and then these are your deep sockets. So even as you can see, the deep sockets are really shallow and still pretty uh, short, relatively speaking. And then you have quarter inch drive Z series, both with the regular head, the adjustable head, We make spark plug sockets as well in Z series. This one's a 12 point. Then you got your six point. This is a really cool piece. It's a double universal. So say you needed to get into an area that required even more of a degree turn, you can adjust this twice. Rather than just having one point of movement, you have two. Then we have our Z-series spinners as well. They can get really small. And then lastly, we want to go over the 3 8 ratchets that we have. Um, like your quarter inch there, you have your regular. Then you have your broken neck. And these ones are also really cool, just some really small ratchets. So if you're going into tight areas, these can be really helpful. You can just hear how easy it is to turn these. Like I'm putting no force into this whatsoever. Make these with the adjustable or broken neck as well. And that's the overview for the demo dealer kit. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to either myself or our order desk at kokenusa.com.